I am a woman in STEM, and that means specifically telling everyone maths. No need to Google it, I'm sure it's correct. For realsies, this is something that you guys have been begging, and when I say begging, I mean almost barking at me for. We're gonna do some science today. We put science day on hold for a while. We learned a lot of things. We learned about the fact that when bees mate, their buttholes explode, but we never did any real science. So today we're gonna do some science. Just instant snow, and I don't know about you, but instant sings to my ADHD. Instructions are very easy. You just scoop it into a bowl and then add water. Wait, I need water? Fill the glass beaker with 30 mils of water as well. Pour the water over the powder and it should result in snow. Wow, this is gonna be so underwhelming. I'm gonna need 30 milliliters of water. Please, Mr. Cameraman. Anyway, this is pretty simple. Apparently kids do this. There's a lot of information in this for what looks like to be the most unimpressive 10 seconds of our lives. Some of you have heard that before. Um, it's full of cool science facts. Uh, did you know that NASA actually uses super absorbent polymers to land spacesuits to keep our astronauts comfy and dry? Can you imagine spending days or even weeks inside the same spacesuit? I'm looking at you, Twitch chat. Measure out one scoop of instant snow and spread evenly in a large bowl and then fill the glass beak with 30, is that? ML is milliliters, right? Pour over the water and snow should instantly start to form. Why did they give me so much snow then? Oh, yeah. This stinks. Yeah? It smells really bad. What does it smell like? What does it taste like? Have you, I'm not. Come on. I don't think you can eat it. Put the tip in there. No, no, because then my mouth will have snow in it. No, 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 do it, do it. I'm not doing it. Science, You're man. a bad influence. Some science. It smells like if you've ever smelled any plastic toy from the 90s ever that's malfunctioning. You remember them little robot dogs that everyone used to have? Those tiny little yappy robot dogs? Did you ever have one of those? That smells exactly like this. All right, they said spread evenly in the bowl. Is that enough? It stinks. Yeah, it says just one scoop of instant snow and then spread evenly in a large bowl. I don't know if I'm supposed to touch this stuff. And you gave me 50 mils of water, right? Yeah, that's right. So I need to pour, how do I pour 30 mils though? So do I just pour two of the 30 mils? I thought you were the scientist here. Um, science is all about continuing to learn. Okay. And I am learning then 20, 30. Okay, so I actually have to pour it to the 30. Are you ready? Get a close up of this. I need you to zoom into this bowl for me. You need to pour some of the water out for me to make it easy for you. I'm a woman in STEM. Speak me, speak to me that disrespectfully again, and I will have you replaced. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready. We're ready. We're getting in close. Oh, well, let's get tight. Yeah, let's see that. Okay. All right, don't make it. Pull. That was definitely more than 30 mils. Wow. No! This is so disappointing. Do something. You gonna poke it? No, nah, but now it really stinks. I think I did it wrong and it's only got two instructions. It smells so bad and it feels jelly-like. I really wanna can, touch it. Can you touch it? I want to so badly, but I am scared of the consistency of this. What would a woman in science and STEM do? They wouldn't fear. Ask a man. You're right, they would. They'd get a man to do it, so that way then if anyone died, the men die first. I'm gonna touch it. Oh, it is soft. It's cold. It's snowing. Oh. Look at that. We did it. Get in real close so it looks like it's snowing. It's snowing. That's the creepiest shit I've actually ever done. I don't want to taste it. It smells so bad. You can do it. So I'm not putting this what, in my mouth. What, what's in it? What's in it? What's in is it? Is it safe for kids to eat? Probably not. So the instant snow powder is super absorbent material called sodium 
Polycarate. Other kinds of sodiums are baking soda, sodium bicarbonate, saltpeter, sodium nitrate, and caustic soda, which is sodium hydroxide. Absorbs way more liquid than a sponge, which is why you should never eat the stuff. So if I keep putting more water in this, it just keeps absorbing, apparently. Really getting your hands into that, aren't you? Yeah, I know. It kind of feels nice. Should I put more water in? Yeah, do it. It's an experiment. Oh, it's thick. Yeah, the more water you add, the more it just keeps going. I wonder how much water you could add. Well, I'm sure this is toxic, right? The polymers stretch out so much that each molecule chain absorbs up to 800 times its weight in water, and the purer the water, the more it can absorb. I don't know if I had to eat this. It literally says here, read all warnings and follow all directions carefully. Adult supervision may be required. Well, I had adult supervision and mine told me to eat it. Let's see how much water we can put in this bad boy. Do I just... It's doing it. Can we get in? Can we get it closer? It's sucking it in. You should smell this. It smells awful. Oh, I think we f***ed it. It's a little less like snow and more like, um, it's jelly. Oh, now it smells even worse. Can you make a snowball? I don't think you can. You can't make a snowball with it. I can make a mini snowman though. Is this stuff supposed to sting your hands? Or am I just now finding out that I might actually be allergic to this? Ta-da! What do you think? This stinks. Yeah, this is hot. Well, it's not hot, it's just, I don't think you're supposed to put your hands in it. Ow! I have a cut somewhere on my hand. Well, <laughs> I've learned something today, and I hope that you've learned something today. I've learned that you should never trust adult super, no, I'm kidding, because that's kids are gonna see this and be like, I'm not listening to you, mum, fuck you. The lady on the internet said, you don't know what you're talking about. We learned something new, that this, which is called, what's this called again? Sodium polycrylate is related to salt. Women in STEM. I, for one, welcome the moment that I get a no Nobel Peace Prize, is that what they're called? For my discovery here today, and that is a snow person.